What's up, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com. Here with your free pick of the Miami Dolphins versus Atlanta Falcons NFL preseason week one matchup. Going down Friday, August 11th, 2023. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel. Smash that thumbs up. It helps us out a ton. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games I love the most, including my daily $19 best bet, make sure you head on over to PickDogs.com. Click the premium picks tab at the top of the page. Well, let's get to this one between the Miami Dolphins and the Atlanta Falcons. The Miami Dolphins. Finishing last year 9-8, and eight, making the playoffs, and uh, you know had a bunch of issues on and off the field. You know, Tua Tungavailoa was in and out of the lineup. Uh, you know, we had to see multiple, you know, annotations of even Teddy Bridgewater came in. He got injured. Skylar Thompson had to be the starter. But even then, through all that, the Miami Dolphins still found a way to band together, get those nine wins, get into the postseason. The playoff stint was short-lived as they got bounced by the Bills in the, uh, in, the in the opening round of the playoffs. But, uh Still, it was maybe a sign of things to come. You know, maybe that there's bright times ahead for the Miami Dolphins that they can finally stay healthy. And, uh, you know, it's been a while since the Dolphins have, you know, won the division, won a playoff game, 14 years since winning an AFC East title, 22 years since winning a playoff game. But hopefully they'll finally be healthy. I mean, that's what it looks like. I mean, you got Tua Tonga Um Looks like he has a clean bill of health to go. And, you know, there's lots of health throughout the depth chart. I mean, you know, this is a solid Miami Dolphins team. You know, Raheem Mostert, you know, um, even uh, Tyreek Hill in the receiving core, Jalen Waddle. The problem is we're talking about preseason, so you're probably not going to be seeing much, if any, of these guys. And that's where you kind of got to look at the depth uh, situation. That's two of the things that I consider the most important when you're betting preseason football, uh, roster depth and uh, coaching, because those are two things that are going to be the most prevalent in the uh, in the preseason and the thing for me with the Miami Dolphins is that they do have starter, starting caliber level quarterbacks and guys that made starts last season. I mean, Mike White signed for the Dolphins, but he had plenty of playing time for the New York Jets. Like I alluded to earlier, Skylar Thompson's had plenty of time as well. And uh, I just you know feel that the, uh, the Miami Dolphins are going to be in a good spot here. You know, um, the, the Atlanta Falcons, on the other hand, they started the year well. They kind of fell flat over the course of the regular season. Um to end up missing out in the playoffs and end up getting a top 10 draft pick. They used it on Bijan Robinson out of Texas. Um, so it helps the run game. And this is a bright young future for the, uh, the Atlanta Falcons as well. Head coach Arthur Smith, the general manager as well for the Falcons saying, Hey, this might be one of the best teams we've had in recent memory. And I can see where they're coming from. Cause this is a, a young and talented team. You know, Desmond Ritter at quarterback, um, you know, Robinson probably going to get a lot of reps at uh, at running back this season, if not being the number one running back. You still got Drake London in the receiving core as well. Um, but the thing for me, though, is I just feel that the Miami Dolphins have the better depth here. When you get into quarterbacks for the Atlanta Falcons, yes, Ty, uh, Taylor Heineke was a successful backup quarterback and even you know, uh, turned into a starting quarterback for the Washington Commanders. But after him, Logan Woodside didn't see on, any on-field action. And you're probably going to see the majority of the action for Logan Woodside and I just feel, like I said, that the Miami Dolphins in this spot just have the better depth. I think they have the coaching advantage with Mike McDaniel as well. So not one I'm rushing to bet, if, if any, in preseason action. But uh, there are other preseason games I like. I just like them better than this one. I'm going to lean towards the Dolphins, getting the two and a half points at home, and that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel. Smash that thumbs up. It helps us out a ton. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. Why are your pick dogs? Check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. And while you're at our YouTube channel, make sure you have notifications turned on so you can be the first to be in the know when the newest content drops here at Pick Dogs. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.